So let's see what is our problem. So this is our problem and we have to determine the error coefficients and static error for this system whose open loop transfer function that is g is is 1 upon s, s plus 1, s plus 2 and h is that is the feedback path gain it is s plus 3. Okay, so let's solve this problem. So this is GS, that is the forward path gain which is given to us. So first we will find out the open loop transfer function. Open loop transfer function is what? GS, HS. So multiply these two, we have 1 upon S, S plus 1, S plus 2. And we have HS that is S plus 3. So this is our open loop transfer function. Now we have to find out the error coefficients. So let us start with our first error coefficient that is position error coefficient. This position error coefficient that is KP. It is given by limits S tends to 0, GS, HS. Substitute the value of GS, HS in this and let's find out the position error coefficient. So KP, it will be equal to limits S tends to 0, GS, HS, that is S plus 3 upon S, S plus 1, S plus 2. Apply the limits S tends to 0, so we will have this will be 3 upon 1, 2 and this is 0. So this whole will be 3 divided by 0, that is KP will be equal to integral. Now the second error coefficient is velocity error coefficient. So this velocity error coefficient, it is denoted by kv and its formula is limits s tends to 0 s gs hs. Substitute the value of gs hs here, kv will be equal to s gs hs is what s plus 3 upon s s plus 1 s plus 2. This S and S, they will be cancelled out. Apply the limits, S tends to 0. So it will be 3 upon 1 into 2, that is 3 by 2. So KD will be equal to 3 by 2, that is 1.5. So KD is 1.5 for this system. Now the third error coefficient is acceleration error coefficient. This is denoted by AA and its formula is limit S tends to 0, S square GS HS. Substitute the values and apply the limits. We have AA equals to limit S tends to 0, S square GS S plus 3 upon S, S plus 1, S plus S and S, they will be cancelled. Apply the limits, so KA will be equal to 0. So we have got KP, we have got AB and A, that is the error coefficient. Now let's calculate the steady state error for this system. So steady state error. That is ESS, it is 
given by first we will calculate for the unit step function so unit step function the ess will be 1 upon 1 plus kp kp is what here we have got kp as infinity so we will have the value of 1 upon infinity that is c now for unit ramp function the ess will be equals to 1 upon kb kb we have obtained as 3 by 2 that is 1.5 so it will be equals to 2 by 3 now for unit parabolic input The ESS will be equal to 1 upon KA. KA is what? We have obtained here it as 0. So it will be equal to infinity. So these are the steady state errors for the various inputs that is unit step, unit ramp and unit parabolic. So in this problem we have solved, uh, we have find out the error coefficients KP, KA and KB. And then we obtain the steady state error for these three inputs, unit step, unit 